to learn how to completely transform your entire life step by step. Get my book, Awaken the Creator Within. You can get it on Amazon. It's $11.99 for a paperback or 99 cents for an ebook. I love you guys. Enjoy. Virgo, let's do your reading. I have deception and healing family issues. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Okay. I hate doing readings like this. Tell me more about the deception. We have someone, fives are going to be significant for you. They've left you out in the cold. Probably ghosted you. I feel like this is a cycle that you go through over and over and over. This is going to resonate with everyone. It's maybe a cycle that you go through with ev like every relationship. But it's because of your childhood, you, you probably have these abandonment wounds. Scarcity, lack mentality. You have beliefs about yourself that you could be deceived. You have beliefs about yourself that you could be misled, that you could be abandoned, that you could be left out in the cold. You need to reprogram those. You literally will go from the five of pentacles to the ten of pentacles. When you reprogram this, okay, so, so I said once we reprogram those limiting beliefs, where do we go? We go right into the Ten of Pentacles. You double your value, your worth. If you're struggling with money, don't worry about it. If you're struggling with love, I wouldn't worry about it either. As your, as your self-worth improves, um, you, one, you attract better partners. And then two... You know how to manage these relationships a lot better, more to your advantage. You're not going to be waiting long for this Ten of Pentacles, okay? You have this King of Pentacles coming in. Now, this could be a job offer, could be a romantic offer. You need to completely, though, walk away from this other person. You need to leave them in the dust. Again, this isn't going to resonate with everyone. If it doesn't resonate, just keep freaking scrolling. You don't need to put comments down at the bottom. I don't have this. I wasn't with someone. Okay, it's not your reading. Move along. Like you need to move along from this past person. This is you leaving them in the dust, leaving them behind, and taking your ball and your wand and going somewhere else. Now, this eight of the eight of cups, he's actually leaving these eight cups. He's going into the nine of cups. Nine of cups is him sitting with the nine of nine cups behind him. Happy. Okay. Satisfied. No worries. So it, it's almost like a lot of people have a fear about leaving these douchebags, but like you end up, you end up becoming happier. Leave them in the dust. Oops. Could have been dealing with the fire sign. You need to get out of your head. You need to get out of your head. Okay, so I love this. Your counterparts. All right, this person is your match. Definitely moving towards success. And the Ten of Cups. I love this. You're moving towards the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Okay? You went from deception, betrayal, heartbreak, being left out into the in the cold, to the epitome. Like, the best of the best. I love this for you. What else do we need to know? Yeah, wisdom. Like you're, you've learned so much along the way. Um, you have nothing but joy coming in. Okay, I have wisdom. This is you really tapped into your higher self, listening to your higher self. Finally, probably have not been listening to it in a very long time, and then it leading you to your highest joy. Again, you could have fire placements. I'm getting pulled to these sunflowers. Sunflowers are on the um the king and queen of wands. 
You or your person could have fire placements. Don't get hung up on signs though. You have a lot of guidance. White birds are gonna be significant. I'm getting pulled to this dove here. Doves may be significant. You're gonna to have to look them up to see what it means to you. People ask me all the time, like what does a certain number or certain things mean? Look it up, okay? And then see if that resonates or see what resonates. Also, recall what it is that you're doing or what is it What is it that you're thinking about in that moment, okay? There may be, like, you may see that running number so that you become aware of something that you're doing, that you're saying, that you're being, okay? All right. Um, let's do general. What's going on in general? Intention. Look, get very clear on what it is that you want in your life. You're coming out of this deception. You're going to navigate quickly out of the deception. So if you're in that energy right now, you're going to be fine. You're going to go from bad to amazing. You need to set very clear intentions, very specific intentions on what it is that you want in your life. And then be asking yourself this question. Is what I'm doing today in alignment with what it is that I want tomorrow, next year, five years from now, 10 years from now? You guys, you gotta, like, you're the only one that's driving the bus. A golden opportunity. Important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them. Dolphins and mermaids. I have to cover this up. Maybe significant. Um, the ocean may be significant as well. You may be... Like maybe you win a trip to travel. The Bahamas may be significant. I don't know why. I'm seeing um, that Atlantis, the uh, resort. Like seashells, all these ocean things are going to be significant for some of you. Okay, guys. I love you. Enjoy.